Well, good morning. Welcome back to the vlog, guys. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and more importantly, Welcome back to the Tesla, guys. Yes, yes. Obviously, obviously. I mean, this is this is the highlight of my day. I mean, why wouldn't it be? This 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 thing is fantastic. Today, I think we're just gonna do. Uh, well, it's, it gets it gets dark in here. It definitely gets dark in here. Today, I, I'm just gonna show you all the Easter eggs. I, I know I've I've shown some of them in the past. Um, this is gonna be an exclusively Easter egg video. Um, the reason being, well, it's Christmas time, guys. Check it out. So when you put the Santa, when you put on the uh, the Santa Christmas, uh, uh, what's it called, Easter egg, uh, what happens is when you when you put the blinker on, you get some jingle bells right in the beginning. Also, Run Run Rudolph plays. Unfortunately, Run Run Rudolph is copyrighted, so um, you got to be careful with what you put on YouTube apparently, because if if, if they flag it. Well, you get a little copyright thing. You get a warning email. You, you don't have to take down the video, but it can never be monetized, all that jazz, so yeah. All right, now to turn any Easter egg off because that thing stays there and well, anytime you put a blinker on, it makes the jingle bell noise. If you want to turn it back off, you just go back into the Easter eggs, which consists of tapping the Tesla logo and then dragging down. All right, so to turn it back off, uh, so right now we have Santa up there, as you can see, Santa's sleigh. If you come back into the Easter egg, you just re-tap on uh, Rudolph there, and it'll say to enable it again, or it'll say Santa mode. Uh, you can actually just hit turn off, and then it goes back to your normal Tesla vehicle. Moving on, moving on then. Swipe down. If you do Mars, now it actually shows you the surface of the planet. You're a little rover on the planet of Mars. Up here, you still have your car. And then if you uh, tap the T up here, you got uh, a little spaceship right here instead of your uh, Model S. And then this automatically comes down. And what you can just do is you can tap Mars again and it'll toggle off. It goes back to the map of the US with a bunch of like superchargers on the map. All right, next the drawing so this is actually rocket man it's a little drawing of rocket man if you tap on him it just comes up with this nice blank slate and I've used this before in my uh, mileage tracker but basically this is just a drawing board you know you can change the color um, I can't draw anything nice you also have an eraser to get rid of things this is the uh Boop. look at that guys Brown. For a second, it just kind of looked like the tree of chicken pox. These are supposed to be ornaments. I know, not too great, are they? Whatever, they're the Christmas tree, guys. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas. Um, anyways, Christmas is actually a week from today. Christmas is coming up, and I, I still gotta get a gift for some people. I know shipping kind of ends soon. Anyways, whoa, what's Publish do? Publish. Whoa, are you sure you want Tesla to, to, to critique your artistic masterpiece? No, the world isn't ready for my art. Or yes, I am an artist. Obviously. Let's see what they say. Uh, we didn't... We didn't get anything. I don't know, maybe they get back to you? I guess we'll see. Anyways, let's go to the, uh, let's go. All right, so we went over the Santa Easter egg, which is actually a reindeer, drawing one Mars and that. Atari, Atari has to be in park. 
in order for Atari to not be grayed out. If you put the car into drive, see it goes gray? If I put it back into park, it comes back to black. If we select Atari, it takes a second and then you get your screen to load. Now, I have done this once or twice. I am absolutely terrible at it. But um, apparently if you, if you pick some of these things, I think, I think you can use the steering wheel. Let's let's see, let's see. So if I hit, if I don't, if I hit start, so now it's on. Yeah, so look, you can actually turn the steering wheel and the little guy at the bottom, you can see him move. I didn't, you shoot with the, uh, with that. Oh, I die. You have these four games as of right now. Um, Asteroids, Lunar Lander, Missile Command, Centipede. Um, so yeah, you can play them, you know, by a combination of these buttons or the steering wheel, scroll wheels, etc., etc. So the reason I kind of wanted to do these was because yesterday I only have uh, five different Easter eggs in here. And well, part of it was, well, Easter eggs are fun. They're like unwrapping little gifts when he, when, when, when Elon adds new Easter eggs. And uh, well, I thought there was gonna be a new one, but I didn't get an update. And the problem is I park in a garage at work. I park in a garage at home and I don't really get updates that much. However, I put my car in park right now and I don't have an update either. But I saw, I saw an article yesterday that said that he released like essentially a fart Easter egg or a, a whoopee cushion kind of thing, but I don't see it. Um, I haven't looked online for videos, but I don't know if he actually came out with it or if they're like slowly pushing it. I know that not everybody always gets the updates. Sometimes it depends on the model you have, etc., etc. Regardless, I don't have it, guys. I know I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't have that Easter eggs. I don't know why they're called Easter eggs. I guess because it's like a scavenger hunt, so you gotta find. I don't know. Anyways, anyways, I know I should be doing it for Easter. I'm doing it for Christmas. It's like, I'm, anyways. Any Eight hours later. All right, guys. Well successful day successful gift exchange and uh well obviously my wrapping job was a hit not only did it look phenomenal i took a um recycling recycling i took a used uh what was it Israel, canada dry we had a, a box of cans that we had emptied and um well i actually put my gift inside of that long ginger ale box and then wrapped that so instead of using you know a new box that we went out and bought I recycled. You know how it is. You know how it is. Us Tesla owners, right? Anyways, like and subscribe if you guys are liking these videos. Really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. Two hours later. Oh God. Guys, we're running like super late for soccer. But there's apparently more Easter eggs. I was Googling the Easter eggs. And I don't know if it's old, but there's supposedly more Easter eggs. So I'm gonna see if that's true or not. Right after soccer, cause we are running late. Luckily we got a Tesla guys. We got a Tesla, so, well, we'll get there quickly, very quickly, cause it accelerates quickly. So if it accelerates quickly, we can get there. Qu Anyways, we gotta roll. All right guys, soccer's over. Yes, of course we won. Yeah, it was like seven, two. I think I had two gold. No big deal. Anyways, uh, back to the Tesla, cause that's what you guys are here for, obviously. So. Um, some of the uh, the other um, Easter eggs. So if you if you go to the car menu, right, you have the car here. If you go to suspension, you got the car here. We got the car up there. Um, if we tap the Tesla T, uh, you got the Model S here. Okay, so if you hold down the Tesla T, you can hold this down, and then it gives you that little like whatever. Um, so it says, please enter access code. If you enter 007 and hit okay. Now it doesn't look like anything happened because I think this used to change as well. And maybe that did, I don't know, but this is still the Model S. But if you go into this menu and you go to suspension, there's there's the, the 007 Lotus that turned into a submarine and you have a different, so this is like uh, depth in leagues. And uh, so now that you have the submarine, you can change it so you're at sea level, which is the highest and you'll see that will lift up and you can hear the car air suspension going up. You can obviously get rid of that location and then, you know, you can go jack mode. Oh, we don't want to do jack mode. Uh oh, uh oh, we went into jack mode guys. That was a mistake, that was a mistake. But anyways, that's the Easter egg, it does that. Um, so that's kind of cool. Uh, yeah, so we don't, we got jack mode. Okay, all right, so, so that's that little Easter egg, pretty neat stuff. 
Um, so that goes to that. If you want to undo it, um, I think you can just go back and uh, get rid of it. Anyways, um, so another thing, if we hold down the voice control, ho, ho, ho. All right, so saying ho, ho, ho is one way to put it into Santa mode. The other way is obviously to hit the Tesla T, you can swipe down and you can just tap on Rudolph. So now if we go in here and tap Rudolph, um, it, it'll, it'll turn off and that will go back to the Tesla. One way to do it is saying ho, ho, ho. That plays Run Run Rudolph. Now if we do it again, but we say something different, ho, 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 not funny. All right, so that's another way to get it into Santa mode and it plays Grandma Got Run Over by a Reindeer if you say, ho, 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 not funny. So those are, are uh, some, new, some other ways to get into uh, the Santa Claus mode. Now, some other things. If you press the, or if you tap the Tesla T three times, it's a shortcut. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's a sh I thought it was a shortcut to get to the drawing pad, but it's a shortcut to get to Atari. I had no idea. Now also, if you go here and you name your vehicle, I don't know if this works, I've never done this actually, but I read about it, 42. If you do 42 and you hit save, it actually saves your name as life, the universe, and everything. Uh, I might be too young to get the reference and I don't feel like looking it up, but if you get the reference, sure. Another, another little Easter egg on, on the Tesla Model S. Now there's a couple Easter eggs that I actually can't do. Um, on the Model X, you get like a holiday dance with the, the doors and the lights and it's all synced to the music. Um, I don't have that. And then another thing which I can't do right now because I don't use the Tesla plug, I use the adapter in my building and at my office. Apparently, I don't know if it's like at your house or at the supercharger or where. Apparently if you have that plugged into the charge port and you press the, the button on the Tesla cable like I think it's 10 times, you get like a rainbow light up effect on uh, the, the charge port. So it's like, it's blue when it's connecting, it's green when it's charging, it's red if something goes wrong, and it's white if it's unlocked and there's nothing plugged in or it's not like connected yet. Um, so those are kind of the different colors, but if you press it 10 times, apparently it does like a rainbow effect and I don't really have a way to do that right now, unfortunately. So yeah, that's not gonna be in this vlog. Supposedly with this, with holding this down and you get to this like, please enter access code. I thought you could enter holiday, but this might only be for the X and that's what makes the car dance because when I do this, nothing happens. So I don't get like Santa there. Uh, there's nothing different here. And uh, well, nothing happens in here either. So, oh, we're still in 007 mode. So actually you can exit out of that by going to the Tesla T and uh, tapping on the submarine. And then if we go back into suspension, it's back to the car. There's supposed to be something where you can like triple tap the bottom corner of the screen. But when I did that, I accidentally called uh, the Tesla roadside assistance number. But I thought I read something where if you tap here three times, a picture of like the Tesla staff comes up. Um, but I haven't been able to emulate that. So I don't really, I don't know where you actually do that because that just turned on the submarine. Um, I'm not I'm not sure where you do that honestly. So I, I don't I don't really know where you do that. But that I don't know if it used to be a thing. It was never a thing. I don't know how to emulate it. So I do apologize. But that right there is all of the Easter eggs that I know of. Um, all right, looks like we're good here. Uh, all right, guys. Well. I hope you guys enjoyed all those Easter eggs. Uh, hopefully they were pretty neat. I uh, can't wait to get the fart one because, well, that's that's kind of the reason why I was inspired to do this video, but unfortunately I don't have that one. So maybe in the future, maybe in the future. Anyways, I think that's it for today, guys. So thanks for watching.